Hello and welcome to a, another Minecraft video. Um, with the new update for 1.4.2, which I'll show you, 1.4.2, I'll be showing you how to make an automatic clock. Now, if you've seen my automatic clock, you remember that it um, uses two levers. And, well, with the new update in the 1.4.2, now um, these uh, the repeaters can be locked. So it's going to be using that new feature, getting an automatic clock to... Uh, keep space um, for like clocks if you want to make clocks for certain buildings or things creations that you're making which in this case I did I know it's a big big for the clock uh, cobblestone generator but it does use my automatic clock design with one level and it does have an and it, see look it's working I turn it off and the clock goes off so um, this is a, a good design um, it doesn't have to be really big, um, so it just has to uh, work. So you just set up your clock like you would normally my other one. Um, it's gonna be on a four delay, so you make that sure that one's on a one delay, uh, one delay tick delay, and you press it. Okay, it doesn't really matter like that I'm aware of. I'm find any problem with it, so. Um, do that and then place that one on four and then you get a sticky piston of course and that's pretty much all you need oh and then um good don't know why it's adding blocks now uh you can have to have this on and then you can have a lever so uh, when you um you get rid of this block Gonna add to this to that, and then you can add it all the way down to the block here. Doesn't matter if it's on beside the thing. Now, um, sh should work. There we go. Clock is working. As you can tell, clock's not working. Clock is working, and then clock's not working. So you can make it smaller depending on where you put this piston at. Um, if you decided to, yeah, to do it this way, I'm not sure this is any smaller, but you can add redstone around, which, like I said, not probably not. As small, as small as just going straight over here and placing a piston down and then connecting the redstone from here. It's not as uh, small. See, clock's not working right now. Let's get it off. Now, clock should be working. So, what happens is it turns off the power source to that, which means this thing is going to turn off. So, it's going to send a signal here when that block goes through, and this thing here is going to turn on and locking that in place. So it makes an automatic, and then it unlocks, sends a signal down, and then that signal is transferred and whatnot. So that's my auto, yeah, this is not needed, but uh, that is my automatic clock um, with redstone with the new update. And I hope you guys liked it. It's a really simple uh, redstone clock that you can automatically turn on and off. So now it's on, turn it off, turn it on. Turn it off. It's very uh, a very useful device if you ever use it for any inventions like so, which I'm using it. However, I'm using a very big delay for the fact that I'm trying to get the cobblestone to form. So uh, I'm gonna be making some more generators like I've been doing in the past couple times. This one here is eh, used the same method, but it wasn't very good. And then this one is the oldest, the newest old one. So. Far, so. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next Minecraft video.